Hi, my name is Dr. Lucas Cusimano, and I'll be discussing our technique for prostatic artery embolization. The prostate is typically supplied by two prostatic arteries, one on the right and one on the left. The goal of PAE is blockage or embolization of the prostatic arteries, which leads to a decrease in size of the prostate gland and improvement of urinary symptoms. The first step of the procedure is placing a small access sheath in either the upper thigh or wrist. The entire procedure is performed through the small access sheath and no large incisions are needed. We then navigate a small catheter measuring less than two millimeters under x-ray guidance into the pelvic arteries. We perform an angiogram from this position. An angiogram refers to an injection of contrast through a catheter that allows us to take a picture of the blood vessels. Here, we identify the prosthetic artery represented by the white arrow. Next, a tiny microcatheter measuring less than one millimeter is then navigated into the prosthetic artery. We take an additional angiogram. Here, you could see the left prostate being supplied by the prosthetic artery. We may perform a special 3D image called a comb beam CT. This allows us to visualize our catheter in the prosthetic artery and confirm we're in a safe location. We then inject small particles through our catheter into the prostate gland. We may perform the perfected technique in which we further advance our microcatheter into our prostatic artery and inject additional particles. Once the embolization process is complete, we confirm we blocked blood flow into the prostate through an additional angiogram. Then we withdraw our catheter and navigate it into the pelvic arteries on the opposite side and navigate our microcatheter into the prostatic artery on this side. Once the embolization process is complete, we remove all our devices and the pinhole access into the artery is closed. The entire procedure takes two to three hours. Following two to three hours in a recovery area, patients are discharged home the same day. Over the next several weeks to months, the prostate, now deprived of its blood supply, begins to shrink in size. We expect an improvement of urinary symptoms during this period. There are several advantages of PAE. First, it's essentially painless, only requiring sublocal anesthesia and light sedation. As a result, this is an outpatient procedure in which patients are discharged home the same day. No Foley catheter is required for this procedure and patients recover quickly. PAE has an excellent safety profile, including a lack of urinary incontinence, minimal blood loss, and maintenance of sexual function. If you have any questions about PAE or would like to learn more, please contact our UCLA Interventional Radiology Clinic, or you could email me directly at the email on the screen. Thank you very much.